Bees are extremely important, both for nature and for people. As Albert Einstein warned, if bees become extinct, the human population would also die out within four years. Bees at present suffer greatly, and a number of scientists predict a less than rosy future. Bees are afflicted by pesticides, American fowl brood, colony collapse disorder, and first and foremost, diseases spread by a parasite mite known as Varroa destructor. Varroa has moved from Southeast Asia to practically the entire world and currently poses the greatest threat. And the situation is actually growing dramatically worse. Without human intervention, the honeybee will not be able to survive in the outdoors any longer. Beekeepers have been fighting against Varroa. They have been practically helpless, however. They use chemicals, pesticides, and acids to try to suppress the mite. These are not efficient enough and cannot exterminate the mite. Furthermore, all the chemicals weaken the bees and the Varroa mite is actually growing in resistance. The drugs remain inside the beehives and hive structures, reside in the bee wax, and may even find their way into the honey we all consume. This is why we have developed a radically innovative beehive which makes getting rid of the mite possible without any chemicals whatsoever. After 10 years of research and testing in cooperation with Palatsky University, we finally managed to develop a thermosolar beehive which can kill the Varroa destructor with 100% efficiency completely without the use of drugs. The bee colonies living inside the thermosolar hive are healthier and stronger and consequently produce considerably more honey. Thermotherapy has been known for a long time already but has only been utilized rarely and with difficulties and it has never been applied in such a progressive way. There is no need for any pesticides, no drugs to treat the bees, the honey from our beehives is clean and pure. The solution is revolutionary as it solves several problems at the same time. The thermal solar hive cures with only sunshine. It exploits the fact that compared with bees, the varroa mites are extremely sensitive to increased temperatures. It works as follows. The beekeeper simply removes the outer cover of the hive, waits until the sun warms the air in the upper section of the hive, and places the outer cover back on. Thanks to the unique technical solution, the temperatures within the hive even out and are maintained over the healing limit for more than two hours. The bees, the bee brood, and the combs tolerate such increased temperatures without any problems. The majority of the varroa mite are killed only those mites attached at that moment to the bees outside the hive survive. The remaining mites leave the old bees on the larvae over the following 10 days. It is therefore sufficient to repeat the treatment once again and the varroa is exterminated completely. Varroa treatment is not the only benefit of the thermosolar hive. Thanks to utilization of the solar energy, the hive saves the honey reserves, helps the bees survive winter easily, the bee colonies develop much faster in the spring and increase the honey yield. The technology is proved scientifically and practically as well. The beekeepers found it to be successful. Thermal solar hives save beekeepers time, make beekeeping easier without chemicals and enhance the yield of healthier honey. We want the thermal solar hive to reach beekeepers from all over the world so it can help save bees and increase the quality of honey. We all want honey without chemicals, and we can help beekeepers produce such honey. We want healthy honey from healthy bees. Please support us.